Hello everybody, Sift here again with another Shotgun King, the final checkmate. So people actually enjoy the series, so I decided to go one more run. Why not? One, why not do more runs of this and see how it goes? I'm not sure how many more I'm gonna do with this, but for now, I mean, might as well play one run here and there. Uh, just for the memes. Let's go on. Uh, let's reload. Now we have the no longer insane a shotgun, I guess. It's pretty bad. Let's go down here, get rid of the rook. Let's also go over here and kill the actual rock because that was the bishop previously. Very nice. Now the time has come to move around to refill bullets. In general, I don't, I don't, I don't really enjoy the the harder levels. Not because of the difficulty itself, but I guess, yeah, I guess because of the difficulty. But the, the, the fact that the difficulty comes from the you know, you're not having a lot of bullets and you have to move around, etc., etc., etc. Like if the difficulty was just opponents are more. It would be a bit better in my opinion, but still, it is what it is. Right click to throw a grenade, but King can't be killed if a knight is alive. This is very dangerous. I prefer this. Uh, yeah, I definitely prefer this. Non-knight's pieces can't cross the moat. And then also the fact that rooks are weaker. Definitely better than me getting the stupid grenade, which I think is not a good thing. And also bodyguards is also pretty dangerous. Just get the moat again. Moat is pretty powerful. We can definitely abuse it. So and that's a thing. Uh, this is white right now, so we go to black. Therefore, it should not be able to check us no matter what. Somebody have learned. Sift is learning. Bye bye. Let's uh, let's actually start reloading a bit from right now. Let's get rid of a few opponents in the moat. Why did I not move there? Uh, let's try to hit the rock. Yeah, but that that was bad. Black squared bishop isn't coming in. Even doing anything. Black squared bishop is toast. Kill the pawns very slowly and head steadily. And now we go for the move around because the king can actually check us. Reload, check us. Reload, check us. Easy knife. Let's continue. Let's see what crazy pass we get. Charge an additional shell. That's going to help us. Ammo regeneration and fire rate. This is also really good. Range. Add one pawn. One pawn is the secret heir. The heir replaces the king if he dies. <laughs> what? This is new. This is very new. This practically is a non-issue. Yeah, what is this, by the way? Remove one knight, add three pawns, and pawns are faster. Let's go with this. Let's go with this. This just adds one pawn. I don't know how this will work in the final boss, though. Just to be clear, I have no idea how this will look in the final boss. Ah, okay. So you get like a feeling about where it is. So this is white squared right now. So if I go to black squared, it should not be able to check us. Easiest way to know, as I have been told. Am I going to learn who the secret heir is after the fact, though? That's my question. Like, will I get an information on that? Now that I have regen, let's actually fill up my, you know, bulletes. Let's reload here. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, bye-bye, bye. Let's regen a bit. Let's regen even faster. Those guys are toast. Let's avoid. Let's go kill those little bishop owners. And these are not bishops, by the way. Oh, did you see that I had like one turn where I was seeing who this that it was the secret there because I was next to it? Good to know. So the one thing I left behind is that refill your ammo and reload your gun. Fire range. Obviously, we're gonna go with fire range. Right now, I have like almost the whole map. Six to eight, and the whole map is eight. So I can actually hit the whole map from here. Well, six to eight means that there is a chance that some of your bullets are gonna disappear. But uh, I will still smack from across the map. Why not? Reload. Uh, let's smack again. Actually, there is going to be like a huge attack coming in if I smack here. Let's just move once. And now we're going to smack. And now we are in check. <laughs> smack again. We are still protecting ourselves here. Let's go kill the rock. In general, I need to get rid of any opponent that I can possibly get rid of. Oh, we found the, the secret air. I guess when you're close enough, you, you smell him. You're like, this this smells like a royalty. <laughs> He has is a royal handkerchief, chief, 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 whatever. Okay, let's obviously avoid and assassinate the king here. Oh, you're kidding me right now. Uh, we're gonna get super checkmated, just so you guys know. <laughs> we're super dead. How much left does this thing have? Okay, we're not dead. Cancel that. We're still alive. Bye. Let's move. Let's move. Da -da -da -da. Doesn't matter. Da -da -da -da. Bye, 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 bye. Okay, six to eight. Can I get no damage? I want power. Firepower, fire arc is even less. Flip current of pieces adjacent to you. Okay, as long as I'm far away, we're good. Protect you from death once per floor. This is also insane. And three pawns, who cares? Pawns can attack on the first two squares in front of them. No, that's a bit dangerous. Let's go with this. Less fire arc, more firepower, and I'm global. Oh, yeah. 
Although right now the problem is that like we will have to eat through the ponds. I guess it's here. <laughs> if I would guess, I would say it's literally in the in the in the line of attack. Okay, let's reload. Let's try to get rid of this thing. This is white squared. I'm white squared, so it can attack us right now. We're gonna go black squared. Here it cannot attack us. Bye bye. Let's uh, let's uh, let's reload first. Let's move a bit to pick up our bullets again. Let's start getting rid of a few opponents. Okay, that queen can attack us. De oh, that was a very bad move on my part. That queen is coming, all right. Uh, it's gonna come here. So if I move back, it cannot actually come next to us. Yeah, well, it is what it is. Last bye. As long as nothing is next to us, we're good. Yeah, it has three life, man. <laughs> Imagine missing a 3 life opponent. Bye. Reload. Uh, yeah, bye. I want to see what happens if the air actually survives. Because we haven't killed the air. We know that it's the... Well, I guess we have killed the air without knowing. Let's just take the gamble. Okay, that guy is definitely not the air. I don't know what the horse is doing there, but whatever. <laughs> Let's go on, right? Minus fire power and minus fire range. Wow, your bullets pierce through one target. No. No. And speed. <laughs> Imagine going with speed. Two firepower, flip card if your king is not on the board. That's perfect. This is perfect for us. And one pawn. Pawns can walk two squares on the first turn. Yeah, whatever. Let's go. Oh, man. We have seven damage. And seven. I, I literally got the damage that I requested. That's very lucky. And we're also not in the same line with the king. It seems to be somewhere around here. And we're going to still blast throughout the whole map. Let's reload. Okay, a bunch of attacks are coming in. Okay, most of them are hit right now. Let's go here, which is safe. Actually, I want to stay at the end of the board. This has two life. Let's go away. So it cannot check us. Ah, oh, okay. If I have a queen move away from the pawn that's a king, then I can see it. That's what I understand with what I'm seeing right now. Let's blast this general, the, the vicinity. This queen is going to come really, really, literally here. This, uh, this knight doesn't matter where it goes because the only square I care about being able to go to is this one. Wait a minute. The queen is going to stop in front of us. If I miss the queen, we die. Like, the queen is gonna stop here, guaranteed. And I cannot avoid with um, with a knight, because all of these are checked. Yeah, the queen is definitely gonna stop in front of us. I think this should hit the queen. It feels a bit risky, but I have 7 damage, so it's more. It's better to shoot right now than if she's next to us, we're gonna lose damage. Okay, we're alive. We found the secret pawn. Let's reload. Let's blast the secret pawn to oblivion. Oblivion! Okay, I'm not at the end of the board anymore. Let's reload a bit. Blast these guys away. Uh, take a step. Blast these guys away. Reload. Blast those over there. Reload. And we're done, pretty much. And we're done. King, look at this. We have 7 power. You don't have enough life. We're gonna move over here. We're gonna just do our little dance of death. Um, I mean, on your side, on my side, we're pretty safe. Repel all white pieces northward. I always for forget to use this. Plus one firepower for each empty soul stone. That's easier to use. Add one bishop. Bishops can move, not attack orthogonally. Remove one bishop, add one queen at the start of turn 10. Okay, pushing everybody back is actually good. Because if they are in the moat, I can use this. And literally everything goes out of the moat and they cannot attack us. So let's go with this. I prefer having one more queen at turn 10. Who cares? than having to deal with a million things in the beginning. And also, like, this uh, the move, bishops being able to move in whatever direction they want is not... Uh, let's go with Northwind. It really, it really, really combos with the mode. Northwind, although I forget to use it most of the time, I will try to remember it. And uh, as I said, the mode is going to help us here. Come on here. Okay, it, it should be somewhere around there. Uh, let's just blast. There is no reason to wait about it. I <laughs> instantly found it. Instantly found it. Nice. Uh, let's just destroy this thing. Obviously, the queen cannot actually attack us right now. Let's hit the king for one damage, I guess. Let's reload here. Uh, I can definitely hit this, but let's actually avoid. Let's mac through. Let's reload. De -de -de. Not on our side, so we don't care. Bye bye, bishop. Let's reload. When I say bishop, I mean rook. Here, the queen is trying to enter. I'm going to push her back when the time comes. Until then, I'm going to try to blast her through death. Let's go. Actually, you know what? The time has come. Safety first. Safety first. Let's reload. He cannot actually attack us. Yes, he's trying to attack us. But she can't actually attack us, as I said. This queen is also trying. Bye. Reload. Bye over that side. Reload. Where do you think you're going, man? Where do you think you're going? Inside the moat. 
Plus one ammo max. Gain one ammo each time you kill a pawn. Okay, that's really good for us. King can't be killed if a knight is alive. That's pretty bad for us. Play an extra turn when you kill a knight and firework is better. The firework on, on its own is good enough. Queen and king have one and two more HP. I mean, I mean, let's go with this. At the end of the day, it doesn't really matter how much HP they have. I do prefer to have a better firework so I can, you know, pinpoint exactly what I want to kill. So let's go with this. Okay, it's somewhere around this area. Uh, let's just start blasting the other side of the map. Yep, uh, let's not open up too many lines. Okay, we got a free turn. Let's obviously reload for that turn. Uh, let's open up the rook to join us from the right. Perfect, that's what I wanted. Queen cannot hit us from there. Queen is dead. Rook is also borderline dead. Another queen has arrived. I don't want to deal with this rook. Actually, I can rook. I can deal with him. I don't want to deal with this rook though, so let's go back. Let's just take a move. We're going to take another move. We're going to take another... I, I tried to reload, by the way. That's the plan here. Rook is dead. Let's set up for the queen. I know I'm in check, but I don't care. That was not the plan anyway. I, I want to kill the king before the before I kill the other pawn. I want to see what exactly happens with the air thing mechanic. The, I killed him by mistake again. Whoopsie! <laughs> Three ammo max. That's really good for us. Add a queen. Queen's move trashy. That's good. Non-knight pieces can't come near the king. This is really good. And kings can be killed if knight is alive. It's also not bad. that bad because I get a free turn. This is this is like the August presence. It's very, very powerful. Like, you can be exactly at the at the end of the moat. And because they cannot cross the moat in one move and they can also not come close to you, they literally get stuck on the other side of the board. So this is really, really good. So we're going to take this. Now I need to get to a corner, by the way. So I need to move over here, for example, for this to be useful. Uh, because in the middle of the board, we will lose the two damage we gain. But we can definitely use it and abuse it. Like, I see somebody trying to join the fight. We just spam the thing and we're pretty safe. Let's reload. Let's go here. King is getting damage. Let's reload again. Bye-bye. Oh no, a horse exactly in front of us. Extra turn. <laughs> Got a free kill there. Uh, this is not going to do anything. Let's mark through. Yeah, still cannot really attack us. Da -da -da. It's on the bad side. Very nice. Let's continue moving a bit around to reload. Uh, let's smash the people that are actually trying to close come close to us. Oop, the queens are crisscrossing us. You know what? Let's just don't, don't care about them. Just straight up, just push them back. Let's go here. Queens are dead now, both of them. Yeah, Sift be like, I'm not gonna remember to use the wand. Blah, 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 blah. And then he literally used the wand like every single best time possible. I mean, maybe there are better times, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean. I still believe this is insane, by the way. Uh, plus one ammo max and chance to push enemies back. This is also good, but I think I want to go with protect you from death once. This is such a good choice. Add two bishops at the start of turn 20. That's also pretty relevant, as uh, as long as they appear on the other side of the board. And if they're on my side of the board, I'm just going to blast them to death. Uh, remove one pawn, add one bishop. Mas minus one max, I won't forget this thing. And also push back is very dangerous. You can push an opponent back into killing you, actually. You know, if a side bullet hits, I don't know, a queen. And if the queen is, for example, here and you're here and you hit it. And she gets pushed, for example, over here. You're dead. Oh, we found instantly the, the piece. Very nice. Very nice for the game to tell us right away. Uh, now I cannot even... I, I don't even need to actually care about things. Let's reload here. How much life do you have, my dude? Max. Okay. Now you have not max anymore. Let's... Uh, let's. This queen is gonna come to this spot, so we're pretty safe from her. Okay. Let's get rid of the queen so we don't, you know, have to deal with her later. This queen can actually attack us right now. That's bad. Um, we're gonna use this to get rid of that queen. We're gonna try to hit this queen and also the king. Actually, just get rid of this queen. Safety first. Safety should always come first. Let's reload. Let's move around. Let's get rid of the queen. Okay, let's continue moving around in general. Okay, we can now also kill like all the pawns. Ah, this bishop is relevant. That bishop is even more relevant. So these are irrelevant. Let's reload. I like how I'm double reloading. Bye bye. Um, you know what? The pawns don't. Um, you know I don't have issues with pawns. I'm gonna leave that pawn alive. Although he got thunderstruck. Fire range for king life? Definitely not. Charge an extra additional shell? Yes. Bishops? Who cares? Uh, I don't want less fire range. I really like my fire range. And um, add one bishop is who cares. And have one additional shell is really important to me. Like, we are losing so much DPS because I have to shoot, reload, shoot, reload, shoot, reload. Like, this is going to give us, I think, 50% more damage. Like, in instead of in... F in <laughs> doesn't matter. Let's go. I don't need to do the math. 
Like every three, every three moves, it's gonna be two attacks instead of being every two moves being one attack. Somewhere around here, just blast through him. That's so much better. Let's reload. Okay, blast, blast again, reload. Look at this. The, the we have expedited the process so much right now. Look at this, insane. And all, even my my free turn now matters. My free turn actually matters now. The the one I get from the you know from the horsey. Let's avoid the death. Okay, we hit him. Let's. Is there a? Yep. There is no. There is no. There is no other. We never see how this worked. Like we have never seen how that worked. So many years. We have not zealots. Ooh, we could have had fought the the secret boss because we have this thing, but we have not the we don't have the zealots buff. So, but it's somewhere around there. You know what? I'm gonna just blast the king until it dies because I want to see what exactly is gonna happen. The queen is gonna coming. Just so you guys know, let's reload. Bye. Uh, bye. Okay, let's go here for reloading. Blast. Got the free turn. Blast again. Queen back up. Did it in. Uh, that's bad. That's really, 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 really bad. Let's push her away. I think that's the easiest solution of how to not die right now. Here we got her. Let's try to reload a bit. Let's just try to reload for a couple of turns. Like, I can maintain my board state easily. Load. How much life do you have to... Dead. Let's see if there is a secret air. I mean, if there is or not, I guess we're not gonna see. Maybe randomly it's like, and it becomes an air. Okay, no, we won. <laughs> as easy as that. Social distancing social distancing is an achievement I got. I guess because I had a bunch of ranged related stuff. I really like this. We were the we were the sniper king. This was not the sniper king. This was the I don't know, the buckshot king. I have no idea what this was. But we had a lot of range. Anyway, as I said, I want to keep these small. I want to have this like, like an off series. So if you want to see like one good run, then I guess this is what this is going to be. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, drop a like. Best thing you can do helps out the channel immensely. Charge one additional minus... Wait, what, what's the difference here? One more pawn, one more knight. And also you don't have a soul slot. I don't know what king is. Anyway, uh, yeah, as I said, this is going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Once again, drop a like. Please, please helps really out. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for the Patreon and the membership supporters. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. <laughs> and see you guys around.